Hello and good evening. I'm Steve Eager. First on Fox 4 News at 5.30 tonight, it only took an off-duty Mansfield firefighter a few seconds to decide he was going to stop the robber who just brushed past him with a knife in a Midlothian convenience store. Fox 4's Lori Brown got the first on-camera interview with that firefighter and has more of the video takedown. This is video you've got to see. Firefighter Daniel Gasky stopped in the Oasis Food Store in Midlothian before heading to work on June 26th. Then a 19-year-old shoved past him and held on a hunting knife about five inches long to the cashier. Startles me at first, you know, just I'm trying to figure out what's going on. Well, I stepped back and realized what was going on real quick. Daniel Gasky says he heard the robber say, This is going to be quick and easy. Give me the money. The time between the first shove and Gasky's takedown is only seven seconds. Gasky told us the careful calculations he had to make in those seconds. I'm going to maintain control of the weapon, but if I miss the weapon, I'm going to be so far or so close to his back that he won't be able to maneuver his arm around to wound me, you know, in the process. Gasky then managed to hold the man down for four to seven minutes until police arrived. He says it felt like a lot longer. After I had gotten the knife away from him and I was holding him down, um, I was able to talk to him very calmly. Many are calling Gasky a hero. I'm not. I, I like to think that anyone else in that situation would have been able to assess and done the right thing too. But not everyone could. Gasky is a Marine who served in Iraq from 2005 to 2006. Sometimes doing what's right involves getting a license plate number of somebody driving away. Today happens to be Gasky's one year anniversary with the Mansfield Fire Department. I saw the video for the first time this morning. I went, this wasn't just, hey, I'm holding until the police so I can get here. He intervened and made a difference in someone's life. Gasky says the suspect, Dylan Bearden, did not put up much of a struggle during the takedown. He hopes the 19-year-old will get the message and turn his life around. I've been praying for him. All right, first, Lori, I, I like Daniel Gasky, and I, I, it was interesting to watch him. You can see him make a slight kind of look. He makes a calculation and then just goes, very quickly moves. Right. It did not take him long to right. figure out what he needed to do. And I think that's why this video has resonated with so many people. It's been watched by four and a half million people now. And one person from South Carolina even called the fire chief saying that he wants to buy Gasky dinner. I think a lot of people are going to be buying Gasky dinner shortly. All right. Laurie, great story. Thank you. Thanks a lot.